we're back out again. I was more tired last night than I've maybe ever been. Now we're on our way to downtown LA. Check out some sites. Mac is my Sacagawea of good LA food. Yeah, this is the real LA experience as far as I remembered it. Not Olivera, it's Olivera. 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 Olivera? Yeah, you're saying it too white. There's not an I in there. Olivera. I don't know. That's how I've always heard. I don't know how to do this. So we're here at Olivera Street. Yeah. Oh yeah, let's hit some taquitos. Pretty crazy. It's like a street market set up, but just densely packed with food, and then you've got some jewelry, and then you've got like toys, decorations. There will always be a line here. Oh, the famous taquitos. This is apparently famous taquitos. I've waited like all the way up the corner. Really? Yeah. <laughs> Lindo. Bien, cómo estamos? Bien, bien. Puedo tener dos taquitos carne con salsa, por favor. You just slap it with your hand? Yeah. Thank you. Oh, super good. Did you get raspberry tea? No, that's my weakness. The straw immediately when I broke it. Show you the old trick. The old Charleston flip. <laughs> Yeah, it's one of the best taquitos, if not the best taquito. It's very full. Homemade. Annihilated our taquitos and the raspberry drink. Bienvenidos. Started in 1772. Someone officially changed the name to Albert Street. It used to be Vine Street. So we're reading this board, currently standing in what is the oldest surviving building in Los Angeles. Kind of this courtyard area of Ila Dobe. So 2004. It's an 04? It's an 04. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty crazy. Yeah, Villa Adobe. It's like a like almost like a Twinkie with raspberry filling. But it's a cold thing? Yeah, I'd like People put them in the fridge. Gansito. Oh, it is like a tinky. Oh, actually, kind of like a Neapolitan ice cream kind of flavor. You got a little strawberry raspberry or something, and then chocolate and vanilla. Nice. It kind of was like a Tres Leches, but without the Leches. It was like one or two less Leches. Right, right. We're back at the kind of square here. Made it out of Olvera Street, and now we're going to Felipe's for a uh, French dip. They got tons of food, but nice. There she is. Hello, how are you? Doing great. Could I get a um? Wow. All right. First bite of the Felipe's French dip. Classic. Looks very old school sandwich. Is there cheese on it? If you asked. Oh, I didn't ask. Oh well. No cheese. Straight into the dip. Super good. I wish I got cheese. That's all I can say about it. Very good. We're working on it. This is the spiciest horseradish sauce ever. How's the dip? Kids. <laughs> <laughs> well said. All done. Very good. Very classic French dip sandwich. The au jus too. Just had that simple salty beef brine sort of flavor, which I really like. It's like a simple sandwich, but very classic. You can tell this place has been doing it the same way for probably what over a century. Has this place been around? 1908. 1908. Like Wyatt here was telling me they tried desperately to keep their prices as low as possible, which is kind of nice. I mean, like I even got you know a full cold brew coffee, like three bucks. All that food in the coffee was twenty dollars. So. 
Super good deal. Would hit again. What's next, puppy? <laughs> We're here now, Santee Alley. That's in LA. It's popping. It's hot today. Oh, it's, it's actually nice. <laughs> I've come here like so hot where I was just like, oh, God, I want to leave. Trying to like get in the stores because when it's hot down here, bro, it's hot. There's no AC. It's like perfect temperature. Show the loot. Show the loot. We made a stop off. Yeah, here we got the two hats. caps. The Violet Adidas and the black curly truckers. Clean. $9.99. See what the Hurley's truck came to us. Hey, oh, hey. How much did we walk out of there? 25 for both. 25 for two. Clean. Diagon Alley. The gel blasters. Dang. That's pretty sick. That's actually pretty fun, dude. <laughs> like, to be a kid these days, I'm just saying, like, imagine, like, you fit two of those. Oh. If these things existed back in the day, it would have been GG's. It was airsoft guns. Is that a real sword? There's, that's metal. How much is this? While you were sleeping, Nax studied the blade. Everyone down here has tasers, and they're just tasing into the air. Like the sheath on this one? But they sell tasers. Oh, true, true, true. Not even the best thing. Supreme <laughs> Got some fake Supreme, 25 bucks. I don't think I'm like high fashion enough to buy and pull off a Supreme bag. Sends the nice. wrong message. So we made our way out of the alley, Diagon. It's a crack pipe graffiti. <laughs> crack pipe graffiti. We made our way out of Santee Alley. Oh, we're walking down Broadway, downtown LA. It's actually pretty nice over here. A lot cleaner, safer feeling uh, than some other parts of the downtown. Yeah, we secured some loot, got some nice clothes, some hats, browsed a lot, got a lot of people's hopes up, but yeah, it's giving Wizard of Oz the giant monster for gentle monsters. It looks to you. Spindle. This is like crazy. It's like the most expensive back rooms I've ever been in. Are you kidding? Wild store. I like $380 frames. I'm not fucking sure what happened here. Right there is maybe the most iconic building in the DTLA skyline. It's the US Bank, US Bank Building Center, but you may have seen it in just about any modern movie that takes place in Los Angeles or in uh, Grand Theft Auto V if you've ever flown a motorcycle off the top of it. That's the one. Check in with me? Yeah, bro. Hold on. I have a good idea to check in. <laughs> no, don't smoke. What do you mean no smoking? No more smoking. This is for the official. There's not allowed to be smoking on the official? No. And no one will even know my personality. I'm gonna take it down. I'll just put a black box like they do in Japanese. <laughs> yeah, so walking around downtown LA, it honestly reminds me a lot of New York City, like a ghost town version in a lot of ways. Just with like, you can see like the sidewalks are empty. Maybe a little bit hillier. New York's pretty much flat. Not all of New York, but Manhattan is. But no, this is like the most I've walked around downtown before ever, even living here for five years. It's a lot cooler and nicer than I gave it credit for before this. Louis. Those are some expensive cakes. Yeah. How much was each of those? The pastry was only like six bucks. So we're all about to take you is gonna probably change your perspective on the train too. Oh? Yeah. Why? Like we're gonna teleport from here to like Hollywood where I live at. Oh, a teleportation? Teleportation. Nice. Well, I've been training teleportation pretty much since we were young, as you know. And I mastered it. <laughs> you finally figured it out? Yeah, I got it last week. Nice. I've been popping everywhere. One of the nicest looking metro entrances I've seen.
Look at this. Come on, guy. Thank you. That man. <laughs> nice man. That man's was just letting people at the emergency exit. I mean, I know people skip the, the fair a lot in New York City, but here, there was just an open door to get on. No one paying at all. We paid, And then there's course, just a man. But... but this man was just smiling, standing there, happy as can be. Come on, guys. I was like, okay, thank you. Now we're on Vine for the Amoeba record store. One more Netflix as a joke set up here. Just everywhere in LA. 10th through the 12th. Back to the apartments. What a time. What a time to be alive. Threw away the camera on phone. Threw it away. Looks like a street resident. Just you want to swap? You want to try how oh, this one rides? Yeah, let me try it. It's a different ride. It's a bit rougher. Like some of the... Oh, f it's a four -way, it's a four -way. This thing feels like a Razor scooter that is like juiced up. It's way scarier than the lime. <laughs> the next mile is my last pile. What the... It's probably just about to shake it. Stick to the lime. It's nice. Lowe's Hotel. That's yeah, the only hotel I've ever stayed at in Hollywood. It's it's nice. Nice. This little courtyard, the very first time I came to California in like 2007, 2006 probably from Arizona. This was the very first place we went, I want to say. Yeah, this was like my first impression of being on foot in California streets. We found our way to Dave and Buster's for some middle school fun. Doesn't get much uh, more family friendly than this, I'll tell you that much. Come up? Yeah. Maybe a little too. Uh, nice. Is he friendly? Oh, I didn't even know. That's insane. Let's go! Yo! Bro, tonight's about to be a movie! I missed it, but there was a major drop, major breakthrough. How many is that? We got 10 of them. If you get if these cards, if they fall, if you get all, as is eight of them, then you get 2,500 tickets. We got yeah. four mini pops, four, no four. dupes. No dupes, we're going five Last for five. Uh, ooh. Ooh, Scarecrow, we'll take that. 